are looking forward to riding Steel Curtain. Yesterday was a perfect day, so hopefully today will be perfect as well, weather-wise, and people perfect. will be able to ride Steel Curtain. Yeah, absolutely, and uh, I mean, just beautiful day today. Uh, yesterday, perfect weather. The dew points are low. The humidity is a little more comfortable. Yes. Today, we may get one or two clouds passing by middle of the day. Okay. Other than that, Pretty much a repeat of yesterday's kind of chamber of commerce weather, yeah. as we were saying. <laughs> Take a peek at the numbers right now. Temperatures pretty comfortable. We're warmer this morning in many spots than we were yesterday. Yesterday, in some areas, we had some upper 50s. Now we're looking at a little warmer start, but still very, very nice outside. 68 degrees in Pittsburgh for the current temperature, 69 degrees in Newcastle, 70 in Butler and Champion, as well as Johnstown and Wheeling. Those are the warm spots this morning. Cool spots, by contrast, Somerset is at 65, Washington, Latrobe, Indiana, also at 68. There you see Beaver Falls just inched up to 70. So very, very typical summertime, mid-July temperatures today, both for the lows and for the highs this afternoon, right there in the lower to mid 80s. Radar, not much going on. You see a little bit of activity that was in western New York last night, central and eastern Ohio this morning. This is a weak cold front that's dropping down across the Great Lakes. It'll come through our area today, but it's running into this dry air that we have in place now. So you can see those showers just sort of eroded as we went through the overnight hours. And now this last little bit of moisture into western Ohio trying to make its way to the east. But again, it's being evaporated and eaten away. By the time it gets here, we may see a little cloud cover off and on through the afternoon hours. So we'll get to Futurecast in a minute. I want to take you down to the Gulf and show you that radar loop again for Barry. Now downgraded to a tropical storm. It's losing steam pretty quickly. Winds are now down to 45 miles per hour. So through the day today will most likely become just a tropical depression. But there you see uh, 45 mile per hour winds moving very slowly to the north northwest at 8 miles per hour. Right now it's just to the southeast of Shreveport. What a, an interesting path Barry had. You remember it was just rain coming down through portions of Kentucky and Tennessee, then hung out in the Gulf, became tropical, and now looped back up. So where is Barry going now? Well, the remnants are going to head north to Louisiana, western Arkansas, and then kind of turn to the right in through southern Missouri. So that means that the moisture will head our way late week. Here's future cast through the day today. We have beautiful clear skies now. From that frontal system off to the west, we could see a few clouds by lunchtime. Then later this afternoon, those of you say down into the Morgantown area, southern Green Fayette, maybe at the most northern point, more likely down along I-68, you may see a sprinkle try to develop with that front late this afternoon. A majority of us will stay absolutely sunny and dry today. All through the night tonight, beautiful weather. Tomorrow morning, sunshine. Little bit of wet weather tries to make its way in by Monday night, but most likely it'll be Tuesday night into Wednesday until that moisture from Barry arrives here with another front. 84 the high today, mostly sunny, a really nice day ahead. Tonight, mostly clear, comfortable. 61 your overnight low, and your seven day forecast shows very nice temperatures today and tomorrow. Mostly sunny skies, comfortable humidity. Then we start to get that heat building back up into the upper 80s mid to late week Tuesday night in through Wednesday and Thursday. That's when we could get another front bringing that moisture from Barry and then Friday a chance of a thunderstorm Saturday close to 90 but dry weather. Lisa.